<sighs> we are on episode five now guys then i'm gonna upload them and see if all of them are blocked because they could be blocked I need to get my mind nails because my mind nails as well. Uh oh. Oh my what? Who else could it be though? Sorry, I, I didn't mean to. I, I, I don't even know how to do that. To okay, it's fine. Okay. I really enjoyed oh, it. A lot. <laughs> what are you two doing in that? How did you get that bruise on your neck? My God, you! I cannot believe it. The actual. Oh, what have you say? <laughs> I love Tal so much. Heart up at episode five. Oh, this is a good season. This is a good season. This one's called Heat. Oh, this might be the one though where he faints, I'm not too sure. Yes, false as hell, false dead. He just needs to like, oh, not to it. I'm sorry, I did it. Oh, I thought we could say it then. Oh, not Mr. Fruit again. Now, we've all been having fun in Paris, but we thought this morning would be a good time to remind you why we're really here. And that's to practice your French skills. Oh. Now, we'll be putting you in pairs and giving you some Eiffel Tower vocabulary to translate before you start your climb to the top, okay? Okay, starting with Charlie Spring and James McEwen. Oh, no. Next up is Nick Nelson and Ben Hope. That can get agitating. I'll give a right sauce, rude boy. Grow up. 
come on. It's gonna go well, Annette, it's gonna go well. Harry, so that they're back in here. Yes, Isaac. Isaac. I won't be able to do anything like in French. Tense. He's angry. Yeah. First Charlie, now Imogen. You're the one who told her about me and Charlie, aren't you? It's your mission to like mess up my life. You never cared about either of them. You used Imogen for popularity points. And you didn't actually like Charlie. You just liked having control over him. What if I said I want Charlie back? <laughs> Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. I get it, I was a dick back then, but I was dealing with my own shit. Charlie didn't even give me a chance to figure myself out, and then you came along, and you stole him from me. Charlie really liked me before you got in his head. At least I was nice enough not to give him a hickey where everyone could see. Okay, is everyone finished? Now, it's very hot today, so make sure you take it easy on the stairs and stay hydrated. Come on then. Oh my god. No one. You didn't get tickets for the lift? <laughs> no. No one deserves Charlie more than Nick. I'm sorry, I cannot imagine anyone else with Charlie. I can't imagine going up the Eiffel Tower by the stairs. I can do sun stairs, but I can't do the, all the stairs. I would pass out if I got to the top. <laughs> I'd pass out straight away. Wow, that's so cool.
โอ้爸爸，爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸爸。爸Don't mess it up like I always do with everything. You don't mess things up. Name one thing you've messed up. Cinema dates. My art coursework. Your life multiple times. How? Charlie, I'm basically the reason you got outed last year. After you came out to us, I was talking about you with Isaac. Someone overheard and. Next thing you know, you're getting bullied every single day. Oh, this is not very comfortable, but I'm still doing it. I'm still doing it. Tell you because I don't want you to do it. But you know that wasn't your fault. Right? I need to get up soon. I can do a workout and get on my day. Tell. We've been friends since the first day of this episode. Hey, I'm Tell. Oh, the young Charlie, the young Tell. Do you like radio? Yeah, me too. Have you seen the Romeo and Juliet movie from the nineties? It's one of my favourite movies. It's cute. <laughs> it makes me cry like every time. Oh, I was so shy and scared of everyone, but I immediately thought how cool and funny. And that is cute, you though. You're the only person I met that day that I really wanted to be friends with. Are you guilt tripping me into being nice about myself? Even if things don't work out with you and Elle, even if you make mistakes sometimes. You're a good person who deserves love. Mm-hmm. Wait, isn't that for your neck? Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> it shouldn't. <laughs> Let's normalise having locks, but as friendships, like writing your friendship name. It's cute. You might think you gave me the second to keep this up. So. To deflect the rumors. Guys, come on, we need to get to the loo. The loo. Good night. I wonder if that's. There, if I go to front, I might as well see how I see that. You have until 5 pm, and if any of you gets lost, we will be leaving you here to get locked in. Darcy. <laughs> this is so funny. This is like so messy, but it's funny.
think I really understand any of that, but it's nice to look at. Yeah, I like the part. You don't always need to understand it to enjoy it. It feels kind of romantic. Yeah. Oh my god. I guess that's true of real life as well. What is? Like, you don't have to understand your feelings completely to know that you like something. You don't have to always have figured everything out. You can just feel. Uh oh. Ha 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 He said that he still liked you. Like he, he genuinely thinks that he still has a chance of getting mad with you. Yeah, right. <laughs> no chance in hell. Oh no, 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 I feel, I feel sick, I feel sick, I, I feel, I, 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 I feel sick. I genuinely know what's happening next. I feel sick. <sighs> Deep breaths. It's, I know what scene it is, guys. I know what scene it is. I genuinely, uh, take a moment, guys, to like, Oh my god. This is it. This is it. Oh my god. Oh wait. I thought that all that was the scene. Wait, it faints, but it's not. I just don't know what to do, guys. I don't know more. Come on. Why do you always do that? Why do you always avoid the issue? Sometimes I feel like you're hiding stuff from me. And I'm not. I've never met your parents. I've never been to your house. And I didn't even want to say I love you back. It was just a casual I love you. You said you didn't mean it like that. But you know I did. You know I do. Wait, does he faint in this episode? Or he faints in... Oh, I feel, I, I feel really uneasy now. I feel really un uneasy. Why do I feel like he's gonna fake fate now? No, 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 no. Oh no. <sighs> that was it. That was the scene. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's fainted. He's fainted. I think it 
The other morning, when I was like, I think yesterday morning, I woke up and I felt really dizzy. Mate, I don't know why, but like, I had I had food, but I like I had breakfast like yesterday, or the the morning after, and I felt really dizzy. Like I felt I felt really dizzy, and my head was my head was spinning. Like I felt really dizzy for a while. I don't know why. It only lasted for like five two minutes. Wait, everyone says that wasn't the scene where the he where he fainted, but it is. <laughs> yes, yeah, the scene where he fainted. I wonder if they're gonna mention it. We'll see. We will see. Oh my god. Do you do? Oh, the foot, the leg rise. Oh my God, towel's got a top on with butt from it. Mr. Joe, come to the rescue. Yeah, I just haven't eaten enough today. If you need to sit down or you just want to rest on the couch, it's fine. There. Right, we'll let you chill out a bit. Mr. Joe is like <laughs> the best. But I'm not sure what the other, other guy though. Mr. Troy. I've noticed you uh, don't really eat a lot. Um, generally. It's a good major. Why not? And uh, it kind of feels like it's it's gotten worse lately. Like I feel like you eat eat less than you used to. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Hey, no. You have nothing to be sorry about. I just, I want to understand. I know I don't eat like normal people. Some days I'm fine, but 
lot of days I feel like I need to control it. I used to do it a lot last year and everything at school was really bad. Sometimes it feels like the only thing I can control in my life. That makes zero sense, you can just forget this. It idea. does make sense. Okay, maybe I don't totally get it, but... I still want to know if you're feeling like that. If you're having a bad day, or... If there's anything that I can do to make things less stressful. Cheering you up, but... <laughs> I'm your boyfriend, Jolly. And I... Go on, go on, go on, go on, say it, say it, say it. Please say it. I really care about you. Oh, I was... Oh, what? <laughs> I was so close. A bit dry. Oh, a bit dry. I think in the 30s, I'll uh, say it. Also, in the 30s, I really wanted to say it then. Wow. Oh, it's the same episode. Oh, him passing out and him them getting caught by the security guards, aka the director, Euros. <laughs> It's the same episode, okay. Okay. This is so... So it's my dad. Um, sorry, I better... Your dad? Hello, Papa? Papa? Oui, ça va? Tu as l'ouvre? On se voit cette semaine? That would be like, wow, I'm going to be French. That's such a like... No, no. Uh, a, um... Flex. Ça va? Tu peux le faire? Ok. Oh, flex. Bye. Ok, sorry about that. He said, um. What? You speak French? Like, fluently, sort of. Um, my dad's French and basically only speaks to me in French, so. Anyway, he lives in Paris, so I've been trying to. Wait, do you like that is such a flex. If my boyfriend ever Slime. speaks French, I'll be like, Charlie. Speak French. Oh my god, you're so green. You actually don't look like you're cringy, you look like you're blushing. Oh, it's the year. It's the director. Love you, Russ. Love you, Russ. Love that. idea that I might introduce you to him. Yeah. Yeah. It's just hard to get in touch with him when he never answers my texts. How about we promise to tell each other when we've got stuff going on? Deal. Actually meeting up with him and how? I 
said I'd meet him in a cafe in 20 minutes. Oh, the iconic train. Oh my god we have three more left i think six seven eight i think oh my god <laughs>